Hello guys, I'm Evelyn. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day. So today we are doing another micro apartment because you guys said that you wanted to see more of them. You seemed pretty happy with the last one, even though I did get a few comments. I feel like I explained in the video why the apartment was the size it was. It's basically a mix of certain things not being possible in The Sims, but also like putting away furniture, for example, which was one of the examples that I mentioned in the video, but also the fact that I'm building this in an apartment. I'm not like doing a room build so that I can choose the shape and the size completely myself. This is built in an apartment in Semi Shuno. So I kind of just have to deal with the floor plan that I'm given and, or like I can do the floor plan myself, but I can't change the placement of the windows. I can't make the apartment frame smaller. So we're just kind of dealing with this. This is what we were given. This is what we are working with. So yeah, but I still got a lot of comments about the apartment being bigger than a real life micro apartment, which it is, but there's also a couple of reasons why it is. So anyways, today we are building another one and I decided to actually call this one a micro loft. I feel like the loft aspect kind of comes in with the bed area being raised above the rest of the apartment. So that's what we're doing today. We're building an artist's micro loft, which I don't know, sounds kind of funky, but we're going with it. So I thought it had been a while since I did anything bohemian because I don't know, I feel like I did way too much of it at some point and then I just kind of wanted to get away from it completely. I kind of have this tendency, tendency sometimes to get sucked into either using certain parts of a color scheme over and over or like whenever I don't really know what style to go for, I'll jump back and go for the usual one, which at one point was Bohemian. I don't really know what it is now. Probably like a mix of eco lifestyle and mod modern, mid-century modern, something like that. I think that's my go-to style right now. I like that look as well. I like it in real life because it's like mid-century modern with a little bit of industrial. But today we're gonna go for Bohemian, so it's not the same style, I promise. And this apartment, loft, whatever you want to call it, is extremely cluttered. There is, there's plants everywhere and clutter and paintings both on the ground, leaning against the wall and also on the walls themselves. So there's just like, there's a lot going on. There's a whole lot of decor in here. I have no idea the price of this apartment, but considering the size, I'd say that it's probably up there. I can't even check because I can't save the apartment to the gallery. The reason that I haven't, like I, I'm building this in the same apartment as I built the last one, but it's just in the other end of the apartment. So I haven't uploaded the other one, even though I said that I would, but that's because I can't actually upload it because of the platforms. Because as soon as you place down one platform, it counts for, it counts as a different room. So the way that we used to get around that with apartments, because you can't actually upload apartments, you have to save them as rooms. And that is possible if you delete some of the walls and then drag them closed again, because then the two rooms that you just split up that way will count as one room. I know that it sounds confusing, but that's how I used to do it. However, with platforms, there is no trick like that yet. So I don't even think we're going to be able to find a trick like that. So as soon as you use platforms in an apartment, you can't actually save them to the gallery, which sucks. So that means I can't share these micro apartments with you yet. I'm hoping that at some point or possibly now they're working on updating the gallery so that we're able to upload full apartments to the gallery, but I don't know. I feel like we've been asking for that since 2017 or 2016. Was it in 2016 when uh, City Living came out? I think it might possibly have been that long ago. That's like four years ago. Wow. <laughs> what happened with time? It was the last expansion pack that came out before I started doing YouTube. I remember that and I felt like I should have started like as soon as I don't know, as soon as I started doing YouTube, I was like, I feel like I should have started when City Living came out because I would have been sucked into doing so many apartment builds for 
for my channel or on my channel, I whatever. Um, so I remember that anyways. But um, I think we've been kind of bugging the team about it ever since City Living came out and nothing has come of it yet. So I don't really know if it's going to be possible. But I'm going to make sure to save this apartment just in case they make it possible so that I can upload all the apartments to the gallery. So far, we have done the one that I did. When was that? Was it last weekend? It might have been last weekend. And I'm also working on another one that'll be up next weekend or next week, not next weekend, not specifically the weekend, probably sometime in the middle of the next week. And then I'm missing one more because I've actually managed to split this apartment up into four very small apartments. I want to call the micro apartments, tiny lofts, tiny apartments, whatever. Whatever term you want to give them, it's up to you. I'm just giving them a title for YouTube. So just, you know, that's that's how it works. <laughs> but you can call them what you want. So if you have a theme that you really want me to do for the last one of the four, let me know in the comments because so far I'm not really sure. If it was up to me, it'll probably turn out to be like a black and white one, which I'm not sure would be the most exciting thing. So let me know if you have any ideas. Otherwise, I'll probably sleep on it and then... I'll go look at it in like two weeks from now. Maybe we'll do like a Christmas loft or something. I don't know. Is anybody else in like a huge Christmas mood all of a sudden? I've been trying to talk myself out of decorating my apartment all day. Also because I know that I don't actually have the time to do that today because I hadn't fully recorded the video yet, which is also why it's up late. I've been super slow. Honestly, I have been... The reason as well that there hasn't been a lot of videos up on the channel this week is just... I feel like I'm dealing with exhaustion and not like recording exhaustion or because I will work on videos too much, but just, just because I'm tired. I don't sleep enough possibly, but it could also be because I don't get enough sunlight. So I think I'm going to pick up some vitamin D this upcoming week. Hopefully that'll help fix my sleeping schedule a little bit. I've just been really, really, really tired and it's been hard to focus on stuff so yeah that's basically why there's not been a lot of videos up this week but I am planning on building something for tomorrow it'll probably be pack restricted so when I say pack restricted I mean base game because I don't do I don't do like base game plus cats and dogs plus I don't know some random stuff pack I don't really do that I either use everything that I want to use or just base game. So if you've been looking forward to that, if you have been waiting for a base game house, I am planning on doing one tomorrow. If it's not up tomorrow, it'll be up on Monday. It just depends on whether or not I finish it in time. Not in time, but like if I if I can finish it. I just need to fix my sleeping schedule. <laughs> I'm just really, really tired. So anyways, I'd also have to figure out what I want the house to look like, which also takes a while because I am super picky. So and indecisive. It's not a good it's not a good combo. So but if there's a video up tomorrow, that'll be it. So I hope you guys are looking forward to it. Don't count on it being up tomorrow though, like It'll be a pleasant little surprise if it is, but I am hoping I can get it up tomorrow. So anyways, I think I'll actually decorate my apartment after I'm done with this voiceover. I feel like it's time. Also so I can see if I'm still missing, like if I still have empty spots for some kind of decor piece, I don't know. So I've just changed my mind in the middle of the voiceover. It's fine. I've been watching Christmas movies since like two weeks ago. Don't judge me. It's been a sucky year. I'll just, I need some kind of cheer in my life. So not to sound depressing, <laughs> but you know, it's a good excuse. Like it's been a tough year for all of us, I think. And Christmas movies, some of them are pretty bad. Like I'm not gonna lie. Some of them are terrible, but still they make me kind of happy because they always have a nice ending. And it's always about happiness and coziness and Christmas so they just kind of make me happy and I've been watching a lot of them lately while working on stuff either editing or building or working on Roblox videos or something leveling up some pets in some of the games that I'm playing over there um <laughs> been working on a lot of stuff but it's just been nice it's like a little bit of background noise and some storytelling and you know all of that so I think it's time. I think it's time to decorate the apartment today, even though it's a little bit early. Hey, it's Christmas in like, or not Christmas, but Christmas month in like 10 days. It's fine. I think the whole cluttering in this apartment just to change the subject completely from Christmas, because I know that some of you guys are not prepared for the Christmasness yet. 
It's, uh, it's kind of like a thing. Either you're into it directly after Halloween or you don't want to hear about it until December. I just, I love Christmas. I wouldn't mind it lasting for two months, <laughs> to be honest. But I feel like that's also one sixth of the year that might be a little bit like overdoing it just a little bit, but I'm gonna dial it down just, just a tiny bit. So I feel like the cluttering in this apartment was actually a reaction to a comment that I got on a video. <laughs> sometimes, it, sometimes it just works like that. I'm not petty or anything like that, but I did get a comment the other day that made me laugh. Someone was like, oh, you think you use clutter? I use a lot of clutter. This is nothing. And I just wanted to um, point out that I don't use a whole lot of clutter in every single build because to me, clutter does not fit every single build. But for something like this, where I'm going bohemian and stuff, it's perfect. So there's a lot of it all around the apartment. And I know that it might be a little bit too much to play in, but I was about to say, but if you want to play in the apartment, you can just delete the cl clutter, but I can't actually upload it anyway, so you can't play in the apartment. I'm so used to just sharing everything that I build. It's so confusing building something that's not going on the gallery. I, I can't deal with it. Please fix it, Sims team. Make it possible. I don't, they're probably not watching my videos, but hey, if you are, just like, Make it possible to upload apartments to the gallery, please, so that I can share these micro apartments with my uh, with with my people. That would be amazing. Thank you. That would be the Christmas gift. That would be amazing. So, anyways, we are at the end of the video now, and I am gonna wrap up this voiceover. Sorry for being a little bit all over the place. I am just very tired. But I hope you guys, since you can't download the, the build, it's super weird not to do that part of the outro. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe and all that good stuff if you did. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye. If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what A good time looks like You can do better So much better